All right, welcome back to the channel, everybody. We got another review for you. Today, we're going to take a look at the Masters of the Universe, or should I say Turtles of Skull Slacker. So I was able to pick this up at Target. Uh, it's not set to release until the 28th, but that is the set date, not the street date. So when I went to my Target and asked to see if they had it in stock, uh, they were very helpful and grabbed it out of the back room for me, brought it out, and I was able to purchase it. So this is going to be my first review on this line. I do have Leonardo and I do have Donatello, uh, but I have not opened them up yet. And I was actually able to get my hands on the uh, Krang and I was able to get him on clearance at Walmart already. So you might see that in a future hunt video. But um, let's take a look at the packaging here. So you have Turtles of Skull, Slacker, and then the Build-A-Figure uh, photo here. So he does come with a Build-A-Figure piece. And um, man, he looks so good. I'm a big fan of Slash, so I know I had to get him. Uh, here's the artwork on the back. Just looks amazing. Again, some good artwork on the sides here. And on the other side is a different shot. Uh, I will show you the barcode if you want to screenshot that or check out my Instagram. I have that saved there as well. But yeah, let's get this uh, guy opened up. Okay, here's a look at the tray shot here. Uh, so you have obviously Slacker. His two swords, and then the Build-A-Figure pieces for metal bottles. So you have the head, then you have the waist and upper thighs. And, and on the back is his shelf strapped in there. And I was a little disappointed because this one doesn't come with a comic. Not sure uh, how long that story run's going to go. Uh, and I hope they do like some kind of like trade back or something for, for the comic. Uh, but it does come with this... Uh, Profile card here. The artwork on the front looks really cool. And then it has this profile on the back. And you can pause it there if you want to read it, but let's go over it real quick. Slacker, evil cybernetic snapping turtle. Mutagen master powers, Faker. Near perfect He Man replica, superhuman strength, and robotic. Endoskeleton and then slashes evil mutated snapping turtle cycle psycho with a spike shell and ooze for brains. <laughs> so you mash those two together and you get slacker. All right, so let's get them out of this tray and let's take a look at them. Okay, here he is. This is what he looks like. Oh my god. Like, he just looks awesome. Like, I love Slash, but, I mean, this mashup, he does look amazing. I like his aesthetics, and uh, I think they did a really good job with him. I mean, he looks more turtle with a little bit of Motu on him, um, which is great. Um, but just that smiling, evil grin he has going on, and then just a little bit of the you know, He-Man touch to it. Um, but let's take a look at the accessories. So you have his uh, sword or dagger, you would say. And then he can hold it both ways. So if you hold it like that, it's like another stabbing feature. But he comes with two of them, all molded in uh, orange plastic. It'd be nice to see a little bit more paint detail, but hey, it's a... Uh, it's, uh, more toy kid friendly aesthetic to it which i love still and then his shell doesn't come attached on him as you saw in the packaging okay but nice texture there and sculpting work okay so. and then there's the inside and then obviously he has a place to hold his weapon all right 
Now let's take a look at Slacker himself and kind of um, his uh, articulation here. We'll start at the head with the bandana, rotates. Okay, doesn't go out. Okay, but you get to rotate it 360. His arms go up that high. That shoulder pad's strapped to his arm, not his shoulder. That's not going to get in the way. It goes all the way around. You know, out and you can get that T pose pretty good. Uh, his elbow. Oh, man. Not much movement or range. Just that far. Yeah. That's all you're going to get out of that. Unfortunate. Okay, waist. And his legs can go out that far. Can't really go back. Okay. And his knee only goes that far. So, yeah, not a whole lot of articulation in this guy. Okay. Oh man, yeah, not a lot going on. He's just gonna be a standing straight up kind of guy. That's yeah, that's unfortunate. So those poses you see in the <laughs> card art, you're not even gonna be able to do. And then I uh, forgot to go over the head articulation here, so you can look up, down. A lot of good range, and he also like pivots back and forth. Goes, yeah, you have that, but not too bad. He said his articulation is very underwhelming, but is what it is for a kids' toy, right? It like has that kid aesthetic to it, but for us older collectors, obviously, it's still a cool mashup for us. Um, and then also comes with instructions these are meant to be uh taken apart and mashed with other figures so here's outlined all the figures or all the parts that come come off so his arms his boots and his head all easily removable and uh, going with that we're going to take that chest armor piece off so it unsnaps right here and then this waist pops right off. So you just easily pull it over. And there you have bare chested uh, slacker. Now that came off too. But. All right. So let's look at the art under there. Of course, it wouldn't be turtles if you didn't have uh, pizza involved. So you have two spinning pizzas here. And you have all the buttons, lights. It's nicely painted on. And uh, hopefully that's coming out. Let me get a little closer so I can get some light on that. There you go. All right. Here's Slacker all armored up and ready for battle against the turtles. As you see, I got his weapons in his hands. Those were easy to get in. They kind of snap in there too. So they has a nice tight grip on them. They're not loose. And then he has his shell on right there. And it doesn't make him uh, back heavy or anything. He has a good center of gravity. So he's not falling over at all, which is great. So there you go. There's Slacker and ready for battle. And then I just wanted to show you the storage of his weapon. I think that's how it goes. Um... I don't really care for it the way they designed it here because as you can see here it kind of bends the weapon either way that I do it going upwards or downwards oh, that came off. it just bends it out so two issues I have with this is that obviously if you leave it in there too long it might get molded that way and then uh, also that there's not two Two spots for storage, right? To keep both weapons on them. 
All right. And then uh, let's go. So is this right here? Might be a shield shell. You're going to have to check that out real quick if he can hold that. Because it looks like there's a place for him to grip that shell. Okay, so yeah, you can use his uh, shell as a shield. Grips in his hand really well. And um, yeah, that, that's cool. That's cool. So he's ready for battle. He has his blade in one hand, his shield in the other. Okay, let's talk about these uh, build a figure uh, pieces real quick for Metal Bado. Like I said, he comes with the lower legs and waist. Now you're going to have to collect four of these deluxe figures to complete this guy. Uh, so, so far we only have two that have released. Here's his head, which is cool. This just snaps up and down. All right. So, so far we have Slacker that was released. And we also have Mouse Jaw, which came with his arm. But yeah, looking forward to completing that Metal Botto. I think the paint on this is pretty good. The gold's not too gold and has some silver on there. But that's it. That's it for the review. Let me know what you think about Slacker. And if you're into this line, if if this is just a one-off, if you're a big Slash fan, are you going to get this guy? Not a lot of Slash figures out there. Um, but I'm loving this line. For me, I'm really only collecting the Turtles, not so much of the He-Man characters themselves. Um, and that's it for me. So if you enjoyed this review, please like, comment, and if you're willing to, subscribe. You know, I do a lot of toy hunting videos, do some reviews here and there, also some also uh, turtle news on my channel. But thank you for watching if you made it this far.